Chelsea, thank you. Applications are now open for Baltimore's Youth Works program, aiming to give teens and young adults real world work experience. Joining us live this morning with more is program manager Dr. Rasheen. Good morning. Good morning. So tell us about the program. Yeah, so Youth Works is a long standing program in Baltimore City. It's been in this city for over 40 years. Oh, wow. Um, so sometimes I have experiences where uh, mothers and grandparents and uh, sisters and cousins have all gone through the program. It is a five week summer program uh, that employs teenagers or youth from the ages 14 to 21 over the summer for about five weeks. And then about how many people got a job in 2022? Well over 5,000, 5,812 I believe is oh, the wow. number where we were able to offer that many youth employment. That's huge, that's a big number. And we know that these jobs mean a lot to the youth here in Baltimore. Yeah, not only do they mean a lot to the youth in Baltimore, they mean a lot to the families. They also help in terms of the community, right? Because when a youth is employed, they are working with a lot of times within their community. They're working at local nonprofits, they're building connections, they're gaining skills, uh, and they're really being able to contribute to their families in, in some cases. And I know for people out there, one of the big questions is how much will you earn? Right, of course. So because minimum wage has gone up, uh, youth workers who participated last year will notice a bit of a bump in their pay. This year, they'll be paid $13.25 uh, an hour with a minimum wage increase for some uh, who work in the private sector. They'll probably have a little bit more. It depends on the employment, but at minimum, they'll at least have that $13.25. Things have certainly gone up since um, I was a teenager. Listen, you and me both. <laughs> A big difference. And I understand small businesses can get in on this. Oh, absolutely. I'm really excited about some of the initiatives that we're doing with small businesses. So if folks are a small business with five or less employers, or I'm sorry, employees, then they can have a youth worker at their site and we pay the youth wages. So if you're a local barbershop or a local salon or just any other small business in Baltimore City where you have five or less employees, you can have a youth work at your site and we will pay the wages. Now, if you're a small business, and you have a bit more than five employees, then what we'll do is we'll pay half of their wages and those business can pay the other half. But I'm really excited about that initiative. So this is huge because not only is it helping the teens, it's helping the community, everybody working together. I love that. Absolutely. It's yeah. the whole village concept. Right, yeah. right, exactly. And tell people how they can apply. Uh, folks can either go to YouthWorks uh, oedworks.com. They could also check us out on uh, Facebook and type in YouthWorks Baltimore or check us out on our IG at YouthWorks Baltimore and they can apply, uh, find the link there and apply. Is there a deadline? There is a deadline. Thank you. So you're good at this. Thank you. Thank you. Uh, <laughs> thank you so much. So the application deadline for youth to apply is April 7th. For work sites or businesses to apply is April 14th. The program runs from July 10th to uh, through August uh, 11th. Awesome. Well, don't delay because that time will be here before you know it. Thank you so much for joining us this morning. Thank you for having me.